So here we are with Sky. Hey, you didn't fight Troy. Something changed last minute. Why have been there? Yeah. Um, I think Amy Andrew wanted a revenge match from our world championship fight um, in November. So a little bit of a change this morning and ended up fighting Amy. How did you find that with Amy instead of Troy? Um, I didn't mind which one I boxed. I've boxed both of them before and um, I was happy to just get in the ring. So, um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't really mind. It would have been good to see Troy, but hey, we'll have to wait for that again. I mean, you did fight two years ago. What's next? I heard there's going to be some champs in Australia or a, a tournament. Are you going to be involved with that? Um, I actually fly to USA tomorrow. Got a training camp um, at their Olympic Training Centre for two weeks and um, going on a Europe tour, boxing in three big tournaments in Europe um, before I come back for our World Selection Nationals. So really busy few months coming up. Oh, OK. Well, that sounds like a really busy schedule ahead. So when are you going to be back in Aussie after all that travelling? Um, I'll be back in Australia in two weeks after USA, but I'll be down at our training centre in Canberra. I live in Brisbane. Um, I won't actually go home till about June. Yeah. Okay. And we've got, I don't know if we asked yesterday, but we've got the WBO World's Woman Heavyweight Championship here in two weeks. What are your thoughts on that having it here in New Zealand and overall for women's boxing? I think that's great for, um, the, uh, for our area, our part of the world, to have such a big um, fight. Um, I don't really follow the pros very much. I don't know a lot about it, but um, yeah, I think it's great for women's boxing and, and great to keep our sport in the media. We're talking to one of the boys earlier. Uh, his dream is the Olympics. Is that is that the same for you? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's been my dream forever. So um, hopefully Tokyo 2020 next year. And after that, after you do get a gold at the Olympics, would you like to go on to go pro and get a world championship? Um, it's never been uh, a goal of mine. It's always been about the Olympics and medals and things like that, representing Australia. Um, I think I'll have to reassess after Tokyo what I'd like to do next, if I'd like to stay on for another Olympics or if I want to go pro, we'll just have to wait and see. And any final shout-outs to everyone in Aussie back home around the world? Yeah, shout-out to all my fans, family, friends. Um, thanks for supporting um, this awesome sport. And thanks for watching. Oh, oh, yeah, we forgot to ask about that. Mayweather, were you at the gym over there in Vegas as well? Um, I've been over and trained at the Mayweather gym. Um, it was a couple of years back now, but um, I was pretty lucky with my timing and was actually sparring a, one of the Mexican pro girls over there. And um, he happened to, Floyd happened to be there watching um, at the time, which was really awesome and um, a really cool experience. He actually came and gave me quite, quite nice compliments afterwards about my boxing skills. And um, yeah, it was a massive um, confidence boost for me too. Really cool. Maybe next time you're over, you could get in a few rounds with them. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> All good. Hey, thanks for that. Thank you.